Dexter's going good. All is good here aboard uh, the good ship Jabalo, cruising Kiwis. We had a, uh, a rough night last night. We'll report on that later. Really dodgy night far out, but we will report about that later. We've got something more pressing at the moment. Yeah, but Mum said, stuff you guys, and she's gone and paddled away. She she's said, gone. She said this boat's too slow and that she'll just kayak the rest of the way to Maldives. I'll show you what we're talking about. We're going to put the sail on. Uh, hang on just a moment. Oh, you see it? You throw it up. Oh, that is so satisfying. Good old Rolly. Rolly Tasker. We love Rolly. I think that's what we'll call it, Rolly. Rolly? I like Rolly. But Rolly's going to be a she. Although the real Rolly Tasker was a male and an amazing one at that. He was a very accomplished and uh, sail maker. Uh, was his name actually Rolly Tasker? Rolly Tasker, yeah. Oh. Australian bloke. We'll, we'll forgive him for that. It's okay. <laughs> Alright, we're currently in hot pursuit of mum. Can you see a little white speck out there? Yes, happy Easter to you people. Uh, is it Good Friday today? I think it's Good Friday today, isn't it? Is it uh, Friday? I have no idea. Yeah, it's probably Friday. I think today is Friday, people, in case you forgot. Which is Good Friday, isn't it? Yeah. Sounds about right. Uh, so Rachel, in honour, it's a really interesting day today in terms of the world of kayaking. <clears throat> and some of you may recall, Declan, what, were that, what may they recall? They may recall, if you were following us in 2022, we helped be the support boat for a lady named Body Hancock, who was, at the time, attempting a world record of kayaking around Australia. And she ended up beating it by a fair margin, I think. Yep. And um, yeah, so we were the support boat for her through the northwest coast of Australia, through the Kimberley and all that, crocodiles and whatnot. Um, and today, she's releasing her documentary about the whole thing in uh, Gold Coast Gold Coast Film Festival. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So we thought in honour of Bonnie, who we were super impressed with, she, she's an amazing lady, and her husband Matt, who is a pillar of support, you know, behind every good woman there's a man in the washing, doing the washing, isn't that right Matt? And Matt was doing the washing for Bonnie for quite some time, and uh, yeah, she's, she's amazing, they're an amazing couple, and anyway, they, she, it was just such an incredible thing having her on board, she joined us. From where, Declan? You, you pick up the ball here? Uh, she joined us from Broome and then left us in Darwin. And how long was she with us for? In two weeks? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was an incredible two weeks. Seriously, yeah. we had we had all sorts of things, you know, we were <laughs> crocodiles, serious crocodile territory. Yep. And, um... Talk about yeah, that. She just... Remember what happened one there? One night, yeah, actually one night there was... It was a pretty close call. I didn't see the croc. One of Bonnie's uh, crew saw the croc, uh, the croc, and it was in a really weird. It was under really weird circumstances. In the in the Kimberley, there are big estuaries that fill up and then wash out with the tides. And we were in one of those outgoing tides and got caught in eddy, and we're just getting spun around for about five minutes. It was incredible. Yeah, and uh, one of one of Bonnie's crew heard the splashing in the water and shone his torch over there and saw the tail of a croc heading away from the boat. And uh, yeah, so that was pretty scary. It was about sort of eight or nine o'clock at night. Yeah. So we didn't tell her. <laughs> <laughs> we sort of said, sort of said, oh, you might want to let's let's pack it in for the night. But Bonnie was, she was the type she wouldn't, you know, she wanted to try and make 100 yeah, kilometres no, every did. day. Non oh, incredible. She was so committed. Yeah. It was incredible. Nothing the would stop her. The pain that she was going through, but still got in the kayak every morning yeah. and paddled throughout the day. Sometimes she'd start at about four o'clock in the morning yeah. to a groggy groggy crew would get up with her, yeah. <laughs> send her off, and she'd paddle all day with 
a couple of you know a few breaks uh, for food and drink and then she would sort of finish again at about 10 12 o'clock at night honestly she would she could she could power for 24 hours a day i mean it was incredible yeah it was and that dot is not she's going too fast we're not know, catching yeah, her we're she not, needs we're not i'm sure she'll figure it on, she'll figure it out sooner or later that we're not catching her and she can probably just wait for us to catch her rachel look back rachel look, look yeah, back yeah cutting across now. She yeah she is <laughs> she's too fast bonnie would be proud yeah actually give her a wave if you, if you see her look back Actually, yeah, Bonnie, if Bonnie was kayaking next to the boat right now, she'd be zooming off. Yeah. We had to run our engines most of the time because she was too fast for the boat. Yeah. I don't think Rachel's kind of cottoned on to the fact that we're not catching her. Yeah, maybe. Because <clears throat> we, we said we'd to put the sail on, go live, put the sail up, and then hopefully catch her. But she's kind of, she needs to... <laughs> anyway. This could take a while, because <laughs> I'm not going to... Well, what do we do here? Rachel, look back. She's not looking back. This could be a long life. Yeah, this could be. Should we just tuck on the engine? Yeah, ah. go throw the engine on, that. Alrighty. And we'll turn it off when we get Pull closer. Starboard. When we get it started. When we get uh, within air range, we can turn it off again. Come back and join us. Just miss that. Oh, look at this though, people. Oh, we're running low on food, but we've got two pumpkins. Oh, we've got three pumpkins, actually. So the, the, the family are in for a, a treat. A Rob pumpkin soup surprise. Oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be so good. Yeah, she is. No, she's still paddling. No, she hasn't kind of cottoned on. Where you go, it's warmed up, it's already it's warm as go. You can crank it. So the engine's going. Actually I'll show you here. Oh yeah, I don't show you the engines. Do you want to go? Shall I show you the starboard engine, the one that's operating? That might be of interest to you. What do you reckon? Is that a yes? Give me a yes if anyone's keen to see the engine. Can't really see the thing. I'm gonna head inside to the darker space, that's better. What are you all what are you all looking at? <laughs> We're looking at Rachel. Sorry, I'll say it again. We we dropped Rachel in the water um, uh, just before we went live, 10 minutes before. She paddled off. She wanted to go for a bit of a training paddle in honor of Bonnie Hancock, who we, we were support crew for a couple of years ago. Yeah, she kayaked around Australia. And uh, her documentary is released today at the Gold Coast, Gold Coast Film Festival. And so Rachel shot through uh, to do that, <coughs> go and uh, get amongst it. I'm just going to do a little course change here. And um, yes, yeah, so she <laughs> is paddling up the storm. She's going too fast for us. <coughs> anyway, uh, yes, that's the deal. Sorry. That's a yes. Okay, let's go have a look in the engine, engine room. I'll change the camera again and we'll duck down there. Here we go. Look at that beautiful tender. Beautiful high field. Look at this. And we've got this new uh, cover that um, was made for us in, um, in Phuket by Chalong. Oh gosh, who was it? I'm going to get you. I have to go back and see. I forget the name. Ch Cholama. Cholama? Shola Mark, Shola Mark Boating Company. They do the um, high field tenders in Phuket, and they made us this brand new cover. And it's absolutely. And look at this stitching. The stitching is like mint. Anyway, let's get in there. They, they stitched up the logo for us. Special like. Pretty quiet, I mean, it'd be a bit noisier when the uh, hatch opens. Ooh. Excuse me.
Yeah, she's getting closer. In fact, oh, you turn the engine off. She's coming this way. <laughs> she's worked it out. Oh, I just got to get out. Here she comes. So yeah, Bonnie Hancock, the film, the, the documentary is called Diamonds of the Sea and it's, uh, she is a really, she really is a diamond, forged under pressure. Oh gee, big, big flying fish just shot through there. Missed it. Here she comes. A damsel in distress, we're coming to her rescue. Yes, we are. So I'll tell you a little bit about what happened last night. I'll tell you a little bit about what happened last night. Um, we were in another seriously big storm and uh, yeah, it, it was it was bigger, way bigger than what the one a couple of nights ago. It was very, very disconcerting, and um, we uh, we were uh, uh, well. I was disconnecting everything I possibly could in preparation for some. There were some massive strikes. Um, one came again really close, like it did a couple of nights ago, and uh, yeah, we were. And, uh, and here she is! That didn't take long to catch you! <laughs> yeah. Uh, are we going to drop the sail or are you going to try and hook up? I think, we get, I think you should jump back on the step, Rach. Are oh, you going to paddle for a bit, are you? Okay. No. We were going, oh, is she aware? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Oh, you're just too strong, Rachel. Too strong! Oh, I'd be mowed down by you, though. Bonnie would be inspired by you, Rachel. Yeah, this was all... But Bonnie, I can't, can't believe she did this every day, all day, every day. Yeah. For seven months, eight months? Yeah, something like that. She wasn't in, she wasn't in a bathtub like this. She was in a sleek racing kayak. It's a highly tuned Viking kayak bathtub, I have you know. <laughs> it's Actually, very safe though. I did think we hmm, probably should have taken some water, but yeah. there's a proud Kiwi right. talking here. Viking kayaks made in New Zealand. There you go. Yeah. Look them up. Yeah. They they export around the world too. Yeah. I believe. And uh, did you mention that Bonnie's made a documentary? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Released today. Today. So in honour of that wonderful woman, that determination. Do you know that? Did, did I tell you the title of the? Uh, the girl, uh, dime, uh, no, no. Diamond of the Sea. No, that's the sub. That's the sub uh, thing under the. The main title is, I kayaked around Australia to meet the cruising kiwis. <laughs> Diamond of the Sea. Diamond of the Sea. Yeah. And if you buy a coffee, there's a wonderful picture of our family in there. <laughs> 
Lost. It's so funny. It is. I'm Right, I'm there. Shall we pull you in? Yeah, I'll. Um, you might need to help Rachel here. Uh, yeah, I don't think you can. I don't think I'm going to be able to get on. Yeah, should we drop the sail? Well, let's see. No, nah, I think you're going to have it. We have a go. Otherwise, we'll drop the sail. I'll just say while well, Rachel's getting organised, we're, we're planning a little thing tomorrow. Well, I won't say what it is, but we're oh, planning okay. a, a little something that I think will be very interesting for you. Really? Yeah. Are we? Yeah, well, I won't say what it is then. <laughs> no, don't, good, you can't even remember what it is. That's good. It's that, Ooh, it's that exciting. Oh, it won't bungee. hurt the boat. I'm to the can you help Dick? Um, I've got no storm in play, I can go. Now you've got to get out. Now I've got to get out. Do you want to climb forward or do you just try and have to? Well, I could. Well, if we climb that side, I could just get on the boat and then. Oh, okay. Oh, that would be better. Pedal across. Yeah. Undo uh, it. Dad, take me over that. Let, no, let me go. Well, yeah. then how would you tie the car? It doesn't. Oh, we can, we can tie it onto the step. No problem. The the... Yeah, let it go. Nah, because it's, so, it's too hard to bring up the car on that side. Why? Well, I can close I the don't hatch. Think that's no problem. Well, there's that rope bring in the way. Me, you bring me up inside the boat. The, the critical thing is getting yeah. rid of the kayak dip one, I yeah, think. Yeah, yeah, I'll get in the water. Okay. I'll... Yeah, here we go. Grab the bottom. <laughs> yeah, grab that. Okay. Whoops, hang on. I'll let you pick it off. I might be able to get to the. You got the. Okay. Oh, you might pull it. We're all live! Okay. Oh. I'm going down. Hold on, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Just now flip it up because it's. Okay. Yeah, okay. You're right. Can you get out of the way? Well done. Come in. I might have to revert away from the wet t-shirt competition. Look at that. Nice bowline tied by Declan. Yep. Well done. Yeah. Oh, lovely. And it's not bad getting in the water, I tell you what. It's such a nice, oh, refreshing little dip. That was fun. We should do that again. Yeah. Take Mocha next time. Yeah. yeah, she'd have loved it. She's, yeah. she's okay for um, Short just a quick minute or two. I don't know if she would have wanted to be out there. How was that? It was really good fun. I enjoyed it. Yeah. I was surprised I was so fast. Not that I was fast, but faster than you. <laughs> yeah, just shows you how fast we ain't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I thought we were. Look at the man gaming on me. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think you'd be that fast. Yeah. Underestimated again. Hey, those, look at that. Oh, can I zoom on that? Sorry, let's give me a. Oh, <laughs> what yeah. dogs? What do you call them? I don't know, the feet of the dogs. What do you call Yeah, what do you call them? Um, guns. Muscles? Guns. Muscles? guns. Guns, thank you. Yeah. All uh, right, I need to go for a swim. All right, you go for a quick swim and we'll catch up on some. Oh, look, we might even. Do okay. we do any questions? I've got a few questions there. Um, right, have talk. you informed about last night? I started talking about it a bit, yeah, while you were peeling back. Yeah, last was... night, well, the, the terrible weather that we were told would hit us two nights ago hit us last night. Um, just the most amazing electrical storm. It was just... Yeah. And, and we were watching it in the distance thinking, oh my goodness, I hope that doesn't come our way. And then it just slowly enveloped Encircled us. Encircled us. We were just on the outside of it and we took a... Yeah, so uh, uh, I don't know what to I, did you look at how many miles it went yesterday? No, oh, no, I haven't. I'll do quickly okay. do that. Right. But some of those weren't in the right direction because we were trying to avoid. Yeah, we were zip zapping around a bit. Yeah. Oh, just... there we go. We did 109 miles. 109 miles, maximum speed eight knots, average speed four and a half. So that's pretty good. Um, considered, but yeah, we didn't make as much progress towards the Maldives as we wanted because we took a dive south to avoid the storm. Not for long, only for a little while, but still. And there goes the boy. Deck me the Should I do an outsider? Yeah, do, do an it. outsider. Yeah. Put the bungee out. Yeah. 
Up you go. Okay. There's also the kayak. Yeah, yeah. I'd rather go the bungee though. All right, you ready? Watch yep. me. Yeah. Oh, Watch me, Daddy. Watch, Watch me. Watch me. <laughs> hey. I'm ready. Woohoo! He's not going to make it. Oh, he made it. Oh. Lovely. Beautiful day out here. Could do with a bit more wind. Did you get the mileage? Yeah, I said 109. Oh, sorry. You weren't no, listening, obviously. I was listening, no. Oh, no, I was, anything, I, I was thinking about uh, the password that you just gave everyone. It's only on that device anyway, so it doesn't matter. We'll change the, we'll change the uh, password if we have to, but you know. Yeah. Uh, okay. Well, that's 21 minutes. Goodness me. Goodness me. Let's I think that's up. more than enough. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Well, I'll just see if there are any particularly interesting questions we need to get through today. Um, Tomorrow I'll be swimming the ocean. Top. Let's turn this around. Yep, there we go. There we are. Hello. Rob's got a few questions to uh, ask. I don't know what it says on here. Oh. Jonathan Scott. What's the water, what's the temperature and humidity? The temperature, oh. I would say, it's not so warm today because overcome. It's, it's, it's very humid today. Actually, I'm sweating this sort of. Yeah. I, I can't tell because I've just been in the water. Which yeah. is so much nicer. Yeah, we'll Eighty people, thirty-three 30. likes. Come on, guys, smash well, the yeah, like smash button. Smash those likes, people. <laughs> Go on, you know you want to. Uh, so, Jonathan Scott, have the fishermen offered to trade fish? Yes, they yes, have. They have. That's the first thing they offer. First thing they offer. And Actually, not always, but yeah. Actually, yeah. one of the boats, the first thing they said, do you want some tuna? Yeah. Can we have some cigarettes? Yeah. Uh, the second boat offered fish, we said, mm, it's okay, we just throw yeah. in some ciggies. They were happy. Uh, who does the haircuts? Ivan, of course, does the haircuts. Yeah. Uh, I do my own haircuts. We may even give you a visual feast of a haircut display of me coming in here. Do we need here, to? If you want to. Anyone wants to put a yes at the end? <laughs> if you. we get 80 likes from 80 people, then we'll watch Rob do the haircut. Actually, no, I should say, if we don't get 80 likes, oh. <laughs> we'll work Oh, yes, yeah. incentivise you. Incentivise you. <laughs> no one wants to see that. My golden locks <laughs> flying into the ocean. Um, Mary, where are you going to be in South Africa? I don't know. Uh, well, I would like to go to Cape Town, oh, yeah, Cape obviously. Town, yeah. Maybe, possibly call into Durban. I think Richards Bay is one spot we'll be at. Isn't Durban a little on the edge as well? Close to, I think, yeah. yeah. I don't really and, know the job uh, from there, actually. No. Oh! But who knows? <laughs> this is one thing. The title of this live is pertaining to this. Our last fruit. Our last, Our last fruit. fruit. I did start to peel this one. Said, and then Robert on, said, hang on, we've all got a quarter of that. <laughs> so we're going to quarter this and we're going to quarter the last Granny Smith apple. Will we ever do a meetup? I'd love to do a meetup. We just haven't. Well, we've never had. We've never, a we've never thought there'd be there. enough people to yeah. do a meetup. We did actually. We did do a meetup in Fremantle. Did we? Did yeah, we? Rob did a free. I did a, one in Auckland. He did one in Auckland, but he gave people like twenty-four hours to no, notice. I said, give them two out, yeah, two yeah. weeks, so they can organise themselves. Rob gives them a day. So, but we did one in Fremantle. You showed your film. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's we right, did yeah. one in Fremantle. Yeah, and, you showed um, the number one. That was cool. Yeah. So we have done some, but yes, maybe we do one in Cape Town. We do have a few uh, South African followers. Cape Townians, tell us, is that, uh, would that be a goer? Is that where you're from, Bernard? Are you Cape Town? Yes, sure. I yes. think so. Yeah. yeah. So we hey, do... Squawk Code asks, says, do you have zeal? Z-E-L-L-E. -L -L -E. I'm going, well, what the heck is zeal? I don't know what that is even, Squawk Code. He also asked, uh, I've got Declan's next flying lesson. <laughs> okay. Hear that, Declan? Score code wants to sponsor you the next flying lesson. Wow! Oh, cool. That's crazy. Should we look six up? Six hours notice, said uh, Clint. Yeah, it was. So nice. it was even six hours notice. Oh, I'm, I'm going to be in Auckland. Who's going to be there? Come on. So, and, uh, so Clint, who's based in Newcastle, Australia, gets on a flight and comes and joins. Gets in his car. Electric car ran out of battery on the way to the airport, running late. Had to sit in the charging station to charge up. And yeah, yeah thought he may not make the flight. He just got there. Flies to New Zealand, he turns up at like 8 o'clock in the evening at this pub and I'm going, he says, Clint, and I'm going, Clint, Clint, because he 
I did not expect Clint to be in New Zealand that yeah. night and uh, far out. That was amazing, really that was amazing. amazing. That's, that's dedication. Yeah. Uh, have wheels love sailing? Can you smell land? Yes, we smelt land Yeah, yesterday, big time. It was very earthy. I, well, it took me a long time. I, I thought it'd be a stronger smell. It's very, very mild. Yeah. But it, yeah, it, it's what I thought it smelled. What did I say it smelled like? Incense a bit. Incense, that's right. Oh. And sweet, it smells sweet. Yeah, you yeah. could smell plants and... Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's nice. It was, it was yeah. nice. Yeah. It was actually really Burn Bernard says, can we stream Netflix and uh, that kind of stuff? And we probably France. could, on the Starlink, we probably we could. could, but we haven't yeah. because it costs us per gigabyte, so we, we haven't done. The boys did Crossing. download some films Maybe. before we left yeah. Phuket. Where's Ivan? Ivan, I hear, is just yeah. up. Ivan, come on I'm in. I which. Come Hi. join us. It's just uh, up. It was a big night for everybody. Daniel, we all stayed up a bit late watching the storm. Daniel Watson, did you purchase uh, the boat in New Zealand? Yes, we did. We purchased it off the Belgian family, um, uh, Loic and... Oh, what was Christina. Is that, yeah. Loic and Christina. Christine. They had three teenage boys. They'd sailed from Similar the Caribbean. Age Some ladies. Sailed from the Caribbean through the Panama, down the Galapagos, you know, speech Polynesia on, sailed to New Zealand, and then sold the boat and flew home. Yeah, they, they had it, I think they owned it for two, two years. years. We've had it for ten. Yeah. Uh, the Bureau Asia says, turn the bell on to be notified. For, oh, oh, yes. Oh, on the lives. That's a good point. If you want to be notified. Yeah, if you want to be notified that a live is happening, uh, if you have the, if you go to this little bell in your subscription feedy thing, you click that on so it's got little ringing vibration things over it. That means you'll be notified when there's a live on. And are there hibiscus you, so. flowers on Rob's shirt? Those, oh, those are hibiscus shirts. Yes, they are. Are they? I guess so. Are they? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. It's a very nice shirt. He did have matching um, shorts. shorts. It was a little bit too much for both. <laughs> <laughs> I like this. I like the shirt. Yeah. I like the shorts too. And, we, uh, bought, we bought it in... Uh, uh, on the Gold Coast. Gold Coast, the southern Burley Heads. Burley Heads. Yeah, there's a really fantastic French bakery there at Burley Heads for what it's worth. Oh, it was Should so be good. passing through. Almond croissant. Oh, so good. Yeah. Hi, right, could you come and say hello? I wonder which. So, I'm literally just out of bed, poor boy. There he is. I was cleaning a pan. Oh, there he is. Where am I? There he is. Yay. I was cleaning a pan. Oh, good boy. What are you making us for breakfast? Well, well I'm making myself yes. a wrap with egg. Oh, you have to leave two eggs for Yeah, the we cake. need eggs. Oh, right. almost, yeah. How many almost eggs are there? Almost as well. We are so... We, uh, yeah. So, we're, when we get across the South Pacific, we are going to have to be a bit better with our food management and or our shopping because no fruit, running out of eggs. We've got plenty of pasta and rice. We've got plenty of meat. So it's just the vegetables we're lacking, yeah. vegetables and fruit. Lucky I'm a good chef. Yeah. Okay, big ceremony going on now. Rob is going to half or quarter the, uh, oops, me again. And me again. <laughs> <laughs> this is a momentous occasion, ladies and jelly spoons. <laughs> You're witnessing us sharing our last bit of fruit. Wow. Actually, yesterday we found two dragon fruit in oh, the yeah. fridge was that was <laughs> that was very exciting they're my favorite yeah. and we halved those and there was much jubilation and joy in the land we're not going scooby today ladies and jelly spoons nope. <laughs> see we bring you the best content <laughs> uh there's two bigger quarters because they're sort of they don't there's three uh yeah. you can't choose them Robert, if someone else has to choose yeah. we won't make landfall tomorrow unfortunately no. 350 miles to go. 350 miles, and at the pace that we're going at the moment, which is not very far, 4.3 knots. I'll send the latest uh, coordinates to Bernard uh, to upload onto the website to see where we are on the map. So it's cruisingkiwis.com forward slash map. Cruisingkiwis.com, and I'm sure you'll find where the map is there too. Yeah, and also, so it's probably going to be three days. We're going to yeah. be three days before we get there. We hope we'll be there in three days. Our vitamin D level should be top notch. Yep. Yeah, we try not to stay out in the sun too long, actually, but yeah, yeah. obviously we can't. We've been burned about twice this this passage, I think. Oh, you have. Yeah. You had a mild little. Yeah. Oh, okay. 
Thank you, Chris. Says he loves us. We're his favourite family. Declan's drinking hydrogen water, for what, if you're wondering. It's a special little bottle we got yeah. a few months ago. Well, actually, in the, actually, this week I am not putting out an episode because with the lives, I think it's too much. You've probably had too much of us. So uh, we'll save that until we get to the Maldives. It is us gearing up in uh, Thailand, so you have to wait a couple of weeks until we get to the Maldives. Um, before I start doing Maldives stuff. Ivan, uh, would you like the some? Oh, at the back of the fridge. Oh, Alright, uh, on this joyous occasion of us eating fruit, I think we can now say goodbye. Yeah, yeah. We haven't decided to not go through the Red Sea. Uh, we just probably won't, but we're, yeah, it's not completely. What's in the water? Hydrogen. Hydrogen water. Hydrogen, little, hydrogen makes the water. Yeah, it's a little, the little bottle. It's a little, um, push the little button here, fill up the water, push this button, it takes three minutes, and it, it separates some of the hydrogen out of the water. Apparently it's very, very good for you. Makes it molecular hydrogen rather than H2O hydrogen. Yeah. Oh, okay. H plus. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, that's, it's supposed to be very good for you. We're taking it. We'll let you know. We're still alive. We are still alive. Yeah. Okay, would you like to sign us off? Would you like to sign us off? Dickie? With your um, signing off song? You want to sing? <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. We are the boys from Go. down on the farm. We really know our cheese. There's much bit there in the chairs. Now it's fine. A space to please. Come in. Really I was going to do that. Goodbye. 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 That's a Von Trap family. All right, see ya. <laughs> see ya. I think we're out of butter.